Remember to subscribe and don't forget to hit the bell icon to never miss an update from First Cry Parenting. When can babies start wearing shoes? As parents, you may be too eager to adorn your little one's feet with a smart and trendy pair of shoes. You might be curious to know the right age. Here, we have tried to answer most questions you may have about shoes for babies, including the right time to buy the first pair. When to buy baby's first pair of shoes? We suggest that you wait at least until the time your baby is ready to walk outdoors. When your baby is learning to walk, you must let him go barefoot. Going barefoot can help your baby stay coordinated and balance his steps better. And there will be no chance of cramping his foot with tight shoes during muscle growth. If you are keen on getting shoes for your baby who's still learning to walk, you may get a pair that is comfortable, breathable, flexible, and has a soft sole. Can wearing shoes develop strong ankles in babies? Babies' ankles are quite strong and don't really need support. However, shoes are great for protecting your baby's feet from injury or cold floors in the winters. Popular shoe styles for baby girls and baby boys. Shoe styles for baby boys, moccasins, boots, walking sneakers, slip-on shoes. Shoe styles for baby girls, slip-on shoes, boots, Mary Janes, moccasins, walking sneakers, sandals. Baby shoe sizes by age. Every child grows differently and, thus, may have a different shoe size. Here, we have some generic US shoe sizes for babies categorized by their age groups. 0 to 3 months may need size 1. 3 to 6 months may need size 2. 6 to 9 months may need size 2.5 or 3. 9 to 12 months may need size 3.5 or 4. 12 to 18 months may need size 4.5 or 5. 18 to 24 months may need size 5.5 or 6. Tips for buying shoes for babies. 1. Don't make your baby wear shoes as soon as he begins walking, as this may hamper his balance and coordination. He needs to feel everything under his feet. 2. Look for signs indicating that your baby is ready to walk, somewhere from 7 to 18 months. Only then go from pre-walking shoes to walking shoes. 3. It's important to choose the right type of shoe that provides ample support to your baby's feet. Get hunky slip, flexible sole, and lightweight shoes for your baby. 4. Buy a pair that's neither too tight nor loose and gives space for your baby to wiggle his toes after wearing shoes. Go for good quality mesh or leather shoes. Warning signs to look out for. 1. If your baby shows signs of deformed toes, where one toe curls under another toe. This happens due to smaller sized shoes. 2. If your baby's nails show some kind of discoloration or inflammation. A tight fitting shoe can cause injury to the feet and the toenails. 3. If there are lumps, redness, soreness on the toes, ankles, or any other part of the foot. If you have other concerns about shoes for babies, you may consult a pediatrician, who could advise you on the right time and the right fit.